Welcome to episode two of this series. It's Minecraft. I play Minecraft. Uh, in the last episode, I built a hogland farm and broke the nether roof. And in this episode, we're going to work on a moss farm. Moss is cool. Like and subscribe. Jump. I regret that. <laughs> Woo, that is a lot of pork chops. That is quite a lot of pork chops. That will last me quite a while. So, that's quite a lot of pork chops. And this farm has been a success. It did take about an hour and a half in order to, uh, in order to get up here. But it turned out pretty worth it. Let's head back to the base. And I will do something. I'm actually just gonna go work on the storage system and uh, I'm gonna work on clearing out that chest monster that's growing there. That's gonna take a while but I, I want to get rid of it. I want to work on the storage system. I want to slowly expand the system so I can hold all this stuff. I think I built the system wrong. I'm gonna go look up how to build the storage system because I, pr I think I built it wrong because I used two repeaters instead of one. I'm gonna go check if I did that correctly. adventure for more copper i got a decent amount but the two important things i found were a piece of bamboo because i don't have a jungle yet but i found a moss block you know this block boom it does that it, it's like booming on grass but this isn't grass anymore it's moss so it's just infinite moss so yeah pretty easy way to renew moss but, the funny thing about moss itself is you can put moss in a composter and get more bone meal. So, like, you do that and you get more bone meal. You can get a lot more bone meal than what you started with. Meaning, there is a way to get infinite bone meal. And that's what I'm going to be building today, or I'm going to be finishing for the other half of this episode. I'm going to be building a uh, industrial moss bone meal maker. Yeah. What are you doing? I got a moss block building a moss generator. No one. So I wanted to show you me building the moss farm and stuff, but I didn't record it. I thought I did, but I didn't. So. Sorry. Finished the farm. I was intending to record me building the farm, but I wasn't recording. So I was talking to myself for about an hour straight. Uh, so here's the farm. It works pretty well. Uh, what happens is the lava gets turned to, the water turns the lava into stone. And the pistons uh, are set on a timer. And then they just get, they push it into it. And it crushes the moss, and the moss gets released whenever the timer ends. So, the pistons are just collecting the extra parts, and then the water gets rid of the top stuff, and then it all goes into this composter. It's really slow. It's... Okay, so what happens is the bow meal gets... Blah, 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 and then it gets sent up here, and then to get used again. And that's maybe 20 minutes of constant use. That's not a lot of bone meal. But hey, it's free infinite bone meal. I could just sit here for two weeks and get infinite bone meal. I'm not gonna be filling a double ch chest up anytime soon, but it'll be enough to last me for a while. 
So after finishing the bone meal farm, uh, I decided to go out and get some vines so I can make mossy cobblestone for the building right outside of it. And then I figured out you can make a mossy cobblestone using moss. So the half hour I spent recording trying to find vines, useless. Completely useless. I had to get rid of all the footage. And this video is going to be really short now because I l spent a lot of time doing things that are pointless. So that's what it looks like right now. I feel like it's missing something. I'm going to add some support pillars, a uh, chimney, some windows. It will, it will look better in the end. But this is what it is so far. The roof up there, that's an expensive roof. This is an expensive roof. It's all made of copper blocks. But the farm's working back there. And then I, the, the entrance is hidden under the carpet there. Uh, it caught fire again, so I don't... I just added more stone around it. I need more glass for the finish that. If you don't know, uh, gold farms are very overpowered, but they take an absurd quantity of magma blocks. We're talking like 11 stacks, and I have 28. After mining a bunch of quartz and blackstone, I just, just I decided to start on a nether base. And guess what? I didn't record it. I didn't record anything. I don't know why, but I don't record things anymore. And I didn't really do much. I just added a couple redwood pillars. They look really bad. I'm, I'm removing them right after I'm done recording this. I did a bit of grinding. I grinded some villagers. I got looting three of my sword. I got a 55 of my diamond hoe so I could break these faster. I didn't do a whole lot here. I did that. I plan to extend all the way and then the same with blue wood, but it's kind of expensive. But I have prepared enough resources for a blaze farm because we got a couple spawners over here. This, oh, I need fire resistance. Let me.
test the farm in the morning. It looks pretty good to me. And it could still hit me. Uh, looting three with blazes is good because they drop a lot of items. All right, see you guys tomorrow. The project I, I want to do in next video, uh, I'm gonna need a couple things. One of which is a beacon. So I'm gonna be need to be, I'm gonna have to kill a bunch of wither skeletons. <sighs> Okay, that was not on purpose, frauds, and I put them in the super smelter, so we can uh, now smell things with the blaze rods, so that's a nice addition. So this farm isn't that efficient, it's, it's the normal spawner farm, plus they can also hit me. But it works good with looting three, and it's enough XP to heal my tools. Alright, but now I gotta farm some Wither Skeletons in order to get Wither Skeleton Skulls so I can fight the Wither, so I can get a beacon. It's a whole thing. Uh, it's not that... It's not that interesting to uh, watch someone kill Wither Skeletons for half an hour, so I'm kind of going to speed it up. And what if something dangerous happens, like being surrounded by wither skeletons and almost dying, I'll put that in. Otherwise, you'll I'll see you once I get all the skulls. So, now that we have three Wither Skeleton Skulls, uh, I'm able to fight the Wither. But we have, we'll have to do that next time, since I've been recording this video for about two days now. And I want to get it finished. So, I'll see you guys next time. Next time we'll be fighting the Wither, getting a beacon, and working on the newest farm. That I'm not telling you what it is. Alright, see ya. So, the video's over. Uh, thanks for watching. This is a decently new series. This is episode two. And if you liked it, why not watch episode one? Or wait for the next episode. That's coming out in a couple days. This is a new series. I think it's pretty fun. If you like it, please, yes, just subscribe or something. I don't know.